Police launched a list of citizens' inquiry to try and find out what had happened to Andre. From the outset, it actually was really ended. Because the door had clearly been opened. Really got on a biscuit cookie. So you can have the pizza like a salt biscuit, not like a salt. And so the local detectives who began the initial investigation to confirm the scene have been trying to piece together Andre's movements, who he'd been with, who he'd been associated with. And who may have been to his flat either the night before or, 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 during, or during that morning. Rebel News was also anxiously searching for his missing big brother. I would spend a lot of time driving around by Andre looking for him. And I remember even going to the post office one day and asking him about Andre because I knew he used to go to the post office nearby him. Of course, there was the possibility that Andre had left his flat of his own accord. And I remember trying to piece it together and make sense of what had gone on. And we decided that maybe he'd tired of this life, this phase of his life. And he just decided to take change. And I think we probably hoped that that's what had happened. It could well have been that Andre decided that he wanted to go somewhere else. Um, and maybe by somewhere else and decided for, for his own personal reasons. So what snacks that have you been eating then? Be apart from his family. No way. In reality, oh, he's asking what sort of snacks have you been eating. Deep down, everyone knew that wasn't the case. Because of the signs of forced entry to his property uh, and the fact he'd left his well, personal like it, belongings behind. To all intents and purposes, it was as though he'd vanished off the face of the earth. The police made house-to-house -house inquiries on the estate where Andre lived, and this resulted in a number of detectives. We've got information about some people who've been seen driving around the area afterwards, which will seem suspicious. Officers tracked down three men and brought them in for questioning. The suspects wouldn't give any details about what had happened when Andre disappeared, but police believed they weren't telling the whole truth. We always had an understanding that, uh, that actually they were telling us, you know, they were telling us. Uh, so, but they were afraid, uh, and in fact some of our information coming to us would say these indiscreet may have been intimidated or been threatened. Although detectives thought these men may have valuable information about what had happened to Andre, they weren't able to link them to his oh, disappearance. Oh, your Fortunately, detectives did have another oh, yeah. in the case. Oh, come on! <laughs> Reported that a red van had been seen in the area of, um, of Andre's flat around about the time he went missing, kind of in those hours beforehand. I can't just be first all the time. Oh, this red van. Witnesses said it was possibly a